Hey guys, it's Kazla. We are getting started with Secret of Mana tonight. I actually never, uh, never beat this as a kid growing up. Uh, and since Trials of Mana Remake uh, is looking so good and coming out this spring, uh, I thought I might as well beat this before we get to <laughs> get to Trials of Mana. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and jump on in. Um, I have kind of seen. Why isn't... Okay, there it was. Alright. Uh, I've done the beginning of the game a few times uh, growing up, but never really got very far. Um, I'm going to try and use the official names for all the characters. Um, there we go. Using the power of Ma, a civilization had grown strong. In time, Mana was used to create the ultimate weapon, the Mana Fortress. This angered the gods. They sent their base to destroy the fortress. A violent war racked the world and Mana seemed to disappear. Before all was lost, a hero with the Mana Sword smashed the fortress. Though the civilization had been destroyed, the world was peaceful again. But time flows like a river, and history repeats. Oh, that mode seven right there. Hey, guys, wait up. Ah. Shh. Be quiet. The Elder will find us here and he'll be mad. Yeah, we're not supposed to be here. And there's a ghost around. <laughs> Do you really believe that? People say that to scare us. But I heard Grandma say something about a shiny object near the falls. That must be the same kind of treasure. We have to find it. Help! I'm falling! Ah! <gasps> oh, phew! No way to get back up. Now what am I going to do? Now, it's funny that Secret of Mana and Adventures of Mana both start with a character falling down a waterfall. Randy. Randy. Huh? The village is in this way. I have to find something to cut through. Randy, remove the sword. Who are you? What's this sword doing here? Uh, huh? How oh, that light. So bright I can't see. Uh, a ghost? Randy. It is I who asked. The sword. Huh? Say what? You mean this sword? Pretty good light is gone in an instant. I have to get back. And I know that like the meter at the bottom kind of tells you when you should attack for like most damage. Whoa, what's a rabbi doing in a place like this? Oh, 
hate that he can attack through the grass. Yeah, this battle system can be a little bit hard to get a grip on at first. Because I remember as a kid, I just constantly was like, why am I not doing damage? Because it was a system that was kind of unlike any I had seen as a kid. Really? That did too? Weapon skill up. Yeah, and your magic and swords have skill levels, which is not the greatest <laughs> system, knowing that from Final Fantasy XI. Ow. Candy. God, just let me get away. It's a good time for a level up. And plenty more candy. This goes into town now. Yep. Did you see that, Randy? A minute ago, something lit up the sky near the falls. I have a real bad feeling about this. Hey, Randy, stop playing with that sword before you hurt someone. Shop. That control scheme is so weird. Like why is the cancel button, which doesn't really make sense. Let's see, is this where we can save? Yeah. All right, so we're supposed to see the village elder. Oh, here we go. Randy, you're not hurt. 
They just told me what happened. Mina, how are you doing? I thought you were a goner. I told you it was stupid to bring someone like him along. You idiots. Were you told not to go there? Huh? Randy? What's that you have? Oh no, it couldn't be. Cool. Do you find the treasure? Way to go! What have you done? How could you have pulled out the mana sword? It's impossible. The mana sword? Legend has it that our village is finished. If the sword is removed, and here it is. It is said that the mana sword has been protecting our village from disaster. So that's it. That's why all the monsters are attacking us now. How could an outsider like you yank out the sword and bring doom to us all? Hey, stop it. You did it. It's your fault. You. Please stop. Ah, earthquake. Oh yeah, the boss fight here. I forgot about that. Help, oh, monster, you have a sword, don't you? Use it. Hey, can you hear me? Watch how the monster moves before attacking. Okay. Oh my god, let me get away. Okay. A ball. I don't know how I'm supposed to dodge that, but it's not been fun. Oh my god. Okay, whew. Way to go! Got swords or You did it! Wait there, I'll pull you up. Ah. That appears to be the real mana sword. Huh? What? It is supposed to be pulled out by a knight in times of great trouble. Problem is, you're too young. Something must have happened to the mana sword. Here, it's yours. Sorry, but the sword is losing its power and must be re-energized. Only the person who pulled it free can do that. What, sh what should I do? Visit Sage Luca in the Water Palace. She's been protecting these lands for over 200 years. Listen to her advice.
Randy, the Elder wants you in his house. Well, I have to be off. Oh, my name is Gemma. I'll wait for you inside the Water Palace. Alright, let's go see the Elder. Elder, we can't go on like this. Yeah, there's no relief in sight. Oh, Randy. You've really done it to me this time. The reason why monsters have appeared is because you removed the sword. It's settled. We can't let Randy stay in the village anymore. If we do, more monsters will come after him. Go. Get out of here. Yeah, on your way now. I don't want to do this, but I have no choice. I'm going to have to ask you to leave the village. You can take what's in the treasure chests downstairs. Love how we have to just beat the treasure chest around. Okay, girl, can you move? I wonder, can I... Can let's see. Um, let me check real quick. Okay, so I don't have anything else. Buy a few more of these. Exactly, Mia. It's not my fault. Monsters were attacking anyways. Okay, equip. Oh, the ring system. Mina, you've played Secret of Mana, haven't you? Have everything you need? Uh, no, actually, I want to save before I head off. I was pretty sure you've played Secret of Mana. Alright, now let me through. You are hereby banished from Potos Village. Now, get out of here. All right, I need to work my way to the Water Palace, apparently. Oh yeah, you did play the horrible new version with your uh, with your husband, I think. Cannon Travel Center. Hi. We, the Kid and Travel Brothers, are building a global network. Going to the Water Palace? Jim has already left. He you paid your way too. Hop in. Don't get hurt. Just slide into the cannon. Or like they're doing with the uh, Trials of Mana remake. That looks so good. Like, the characters actually, like, emote and stuff, unlike... Oh, what is going on? We came for Pandora to fight Eleni, the witch in the haunted forest. Okay. Let's go, Randy. Let's 
So, now what? Hey, you. Where's Luca? Hey, how rude. Luca, it's nice to see you again. Ha <laughs> welcome. What? You mean this girl is 200 years old? Oh, and I can freely move. Luca, monsters are invading villages. He just fought one. I know. The ebb and flow of water brings me news from around the world. Mana's power is growing weak. That's why this boy was able to take the sword. When he did, the balance of mana in this area shifted and monsters revived. There are evil monsters working to steal away the power of the mana sword. By defeating those evil monsters, you can restore the sword's mana power. The power is kept in orbs. Looks like it regains some power from the mantis ant. There must be more hidden orbs which hold mana power for the sword. And you must find someone who can forge the sword to release its stored power. Okay. Gemma, watch out for the Empire. It seeks to obtain the Mana Fortress. You mean the one that destroys the world in that fairy tale? That's no fairy tale. The Empire is trying to awaken it. The Empire is going to unlock the seals from the world's Mana Seeds. A bunch of strangers have already started snooping around this palace. Something is very wrong in Pandora. Could the Empire be involved? I don't know. Gemma, see the King of Pandora and tell him to be cautious. Right, I'm on my way. Randy, you go to the cave called Gaia's Navel. Dwarves live in that cave. They make good weapons and know all about weapons. They may know somebody who can reforge and empower that sword of yours. As your sword's power and skill level increase, so too will your ability. Alright, so Gaia's name is where we have to go. Um... Is this, is this where I'm supposed to go? Okay, apparently not. Um, I played this as a kid, but I never really got very far. I think my brother did a lot more than this. Uh, do I need to talk to her again? Randy, what are you so scared of? The fortress. Eons ago, the ancients used the Mana Fortress in their final battle. But even they could not control Mana. In the end, it was your sword that saved the world. Survivors rebuilt the world to honor Mana. That's the Mana Sword, but its power is gone. It used, the last, it used its last ounce of power to summon you. Why me? Why did it choose me? I don't know. But now you must re-energize it. No way! Randy, the Empire must not restore the fortress. Regain the sword's power first, or all is lost. What should I do? You must become a hero who is worthy of the sword. Okay. <laughs> Enough. Hold the sword up to the seed. For a moment, the seed and the sword became one. You have sealed the mana seed with your mana sword. Now the mana power from the seed will only be sent away. Now the mana power from the seed will be sent only to you and your sword. You'll be able to gain power from the Mana Seed wherever you are. The world has eight palaces. Visit them all and receive the power from them all. Take this spear with you. Mana Guardians used it long ago. It 
It will grow and regain its power, just like your mana sword. There must be more weapons like this spear in the world. Find them. I'll restore you. And yes, I'll save. First, head for Gaia's navel, like Gemma said. Look for the underground palace. To reach Gaia's navel, held south through the realm of Pandora. All right, so we've got to head south. Uh, actually, let me see if I can equip that. Maybe I have to be outside where I can actually do stuff. Oh, it is stronger. 